okay as i said uh, today we are going to uh, see about the topic computer network in that uh, we are going to see uh, what about uh, what are things in input uh, layers and what are the uh, technologies are used uh, being used in the network layers okay so we are going to discuss and uh, know about the topics okay so uh, firstly uh, we are going to see the history of uh, the network so uh, we all know the technologies we are being used but uh, we may or may not uh, know about the history because uh, before that i will tell you one thing uh, uh, gate is a entrance exam uh, we are being used to uh, score uh, more marks and we may get a job uh, higher studies we can go through uh, abroad uh, higher studies like that so a uh, gate will uh, play a major role uh, nowadays so uh, we should know about the gate uh, exam uh, so uh, please uh, do prepare for that uh, uh, even though we have uh, we have uh, know about the tanset but uh, tanset is a uh, is just a primary level but gate is a standard level and standard and external level uh, for engineering students uh, we all know uh, so that uh, gate is also uh, is used for uh, your work uh, and your higher studies so you can use uh, in both uh, ways one for your uh, studies and for your job related things okay uh, so that uh, if you um, choose one stream means you can uh, tackle both uh, both the things you can also use for your higher studies and also for your uh, job okay uh, so uh, while reading while studying so be concentrated on what you're learning so do concentrate and uh, uh, do concentrate on your studies while reading uh, know the concept in depth uh, don't uh, read uh, on uh, overview or just a uh, just a two to two to three points not like that just read and uh, know the concept thoroughly so that you can able to answer the basic question as well as the uh, in depth and uh, like uh, hidden questions you can uh, able to know what are the things uh, is uh, is being asked some questions some basic questions will be asked in a, um, a standard manner but we uh, we know the answer but the question is uh, being asked hidden so we should know the concept very clearly okay mm, first okay um, the network uh, history we should know the history uh, where we, uh, how it is created and how it is being used uh, nowadays and later days mm, okay. uh, a network is a group of connected connected communi communicating devices such as computer and printers so we are being used uh, the network network uh, which means uh, net um, in normal word net is used as a we all know the net uh, mosquito net uh, or a fishing net uh, which means which means what uh, what is the use of that uh, to catch or uh, to break through the um, to catch uh, mosquitoes or fish okay so likewise we used connect one thing or to catch something from the google or anything else from the social network so a network is being used uh to connect uh one to one or one to many so that we are using a network okay uh so we uh, some people will say uh, i have a, a very big network which means uh, they are connected to a, a group of people so social network uh so like that uh by people we used to say i have a huge network have a, a great network uh behind me by purse for person we used to say for network is a connecting one or two more devices or to a uh, website or to a uh, building or some to uh, some to that technology level okay so it's a group of connected communicating devices such as computers or printers so um, basically we used to say uh, computers um, used to connect computers um, computers mobile devices like that printers uh, for printers we used to connect by wi-fi connectors uh for, sorry uh, for computers we used to connect through lan uh, wi-fi or modem like that we used to connect so that uh, for mobile phones we used to connect data or mobile data wi-fi or otg like that we used to connect so it's it's a uh, the basic level the basic word is uh, to connect so by network okay uh, so um, is that pp ppt uh, visible 
can you able to uh, see the uh, ppt yes or no you can see the ppt right you can say for no i am audible hello hello shiva shanmug raja you can say pa not audible not visible ah okay uh, audible ma'am audible only ma'am okay ppt yes ma'am visible ma'am Okay. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, first, we uh, we see about a network where we are being used. Uh, what are the things uh, behind the network? Okay. Second thing, uh, where it is being used, uh, like a uh, school, research facilities, corporation, libraries, and uh, some houses. Uh, so, like uh, individual by person to person, we are using network. So, uh, where we are using means we can using by schools. and the uh, research centers and uh, or uh, uh, government buildings um, like that we are being used so millions of users are being uh, using uh, this network day to day to day life they are you it been a part of your it, it been a part of a life right network is being connected to uh, it's being stitching to our um, uh, day to day life okay uh, in the in mid of uh, 1960s sorry in mid of 1960s the main frame computer in research organization will, uh, were stand alone devices computers from different manufacturers were unable to communicate with one another so uh, with one another so in the late uh, in the mid of 1960s the, uh, the first computer is called main frame computer which being used is a uh, main frame computer is uh, is called a stand alone stand alone devices which means a single device is being used not uh, they have in uh, now we are having um, so many connected uh, so many computers are being used and we are connecting uh, to one to one but in mid, mid of 1960s uh, um, some some questions we may uh, ask by uh, the year uh, which in which year uh, the main frame computers being used uh, we should know the 1960 is the answer okay uh, we should uh, know the year also uh, in which year uh, which uh, technology is being used and which uh, version is being uh, which which version which technology is being used in that days we should know that uh, to okay uh, so main frame computer is being used and uh, in the time of 1960s so they have um, they can't able to communicate to one another because they having a single device um, to uh, to connect uh, for network we used uh, we we need we need two devices right but they have only single device so they can't um, able to connect uh, two more device but uh, so that they are uh, the advanced research product uh, agent so they um, uh, research they do uh, projects on this uh, uh, to connect uh, one to another uh, device so they uh, they been interested to find a way to how to connect uh, one to uh, to our uh, more devices so um, so uh, it being a part it been difficult to uh, know how to connect how to uh, how to divide how to um, function it in a proper way how to uh, make it successful the advanced research product agent they only uh, initiated uh, the network uh, system uh, to connect one or two more devices so then in 1967 uh, association for computing manufacture uh, machinery so they conducted a meeting and also presented some ideas for arpanet which means the uh, advanced research project agency so they uh, this uh, computing machinery um, Uh, in uh, in in that uh, computing machinery meeting uh, they gave some ideas for apranet so uh, to how to uh, design how to manufacture if a, if a if a staff asking some question means if if, we, if the staff is handling some 
problem means we can give some ideas right so like that uh, some people uh, some volunteers came to uh, uh, give some ideas how to connect uh, some researchers uh, gave an idea to how to uh, implement the project so a small network of computer uh, connected computers uh, they being used uh, because uh, if we uh, if the researcher uh, doing a um, big project means uh, the cost will be high uh, everything the space uh, and the maintenance will be high so that they uh, started with a small connected networks um, like uh, one two two uh, like that uh, they are being used so that they, they can able to know uh, where is uh, where the problem is where, uh, where are they are uh, being uh, backward so they can able to know uh, they um, backlogs like that so they uh, started with uh, some few computers so they uh, they uh, nearly uh, came to know some ideas uh, to ho how to host the computer and how they uh, how to attach uh, uh, how to attach the ip addresses how to uh, make it uh, to connect uh, like that they have they have done so but still they can't able to um, they can't able to do so each uh, imp interface message processor so this helps uh, them to uh, do connect uh, to the one to one system so it had able to communicate with other imp as well as with its own attached host host if i am uh, now i am the host of this meeting so i can able to give message right so i can able to connect connect with you people so likewise they uh, they created this idea so one host can give a message to another uh, first they initiated uh, this process okay uh, now uh, the one person can uh, give some idea means so uh, first uh, host can uh, give if host gives idea means they can able to um, they, they can able to connect one to another so this uh, process uh, made uh, make success, successful to the ideas so that uh, it has four nodes uh, it has four nodes at the university of california at los, uh, los angeles in that place only they, uh, they they have done this project as well so some more uh, okay, some more uh, Uh, some more uh, universities, some more researchers uh, give uh, give the hand to them uh, or to or make it more efficient and uh, uh, successful. So they have uh, later they have been used end to end uh, encryption, uh, TCP, uh, data grams and gateway so that uh, they've been implemented and uh, uh, built up bit layer uh, to make it successful. So they are being used. Uh, a uh, very uh, small set of networks uh, to make it successful so uh, if the project is successful means they uh, they uh, tried with a uh, big uh, big space of computers uh, uh, with more uh, computers so they have been used in later days uh, in 1973 and uh, later on and later on 90s 80s and 90s 20s uh, so now till now only they are being such a researching how to um, connect uh, a wide range of network like they, they have been uh, introducing uh, like today uh, we are being using a uh, 5 uh, 5g network so uh, the connectivity range is being uh, getting uh, more efficient um, is being very very broadband to every um, set of ranges uh, every set of uh, years and um, so on okay um okay this is the history of a uh, network now uh, we'll go to the network introduction so what is a network why it is being used and how uh, what are the types what are the things we are being used is being used a network is a set of devices so uh, for network we need one to two minimum one we should uh, transfer a message or a data um, to another so the minimum requirement is one two system one to one so the network is a set of devices connected by communication link communication link is the uh, is in the sense uh, uh, by lan or by wi-fi the medium which uh, communication link is a uh, mean by medium
okay uh, so a note can be a computer printer or mobile devices um, which which has a uh, sending and receiving capability so uh, if a computer uh, if, a, if we are using a computer and printer means we are giving instruction we are giving you are passing uh, the uh, instruction uh, to give, give print control p um, uh which we, if we give uh, control payments the data will be printed in the the sender is a computer the receiver is a user is our printer right so if we give control p means what uh, the sender the sender gives control payments the printer is the receiver which uh, which will print the data which is in the sender so it is a connected device right so the, it is a simple connected device um for example i, I said this is for a simple example uh, if you think if you are sharing let if you are using uh, if i mailing uh, some more devices if you if you are mailing means if i am a uh, sender means i will forward to all the students all the uh, people uh, who are uh, which need which the data need to be uh, mailed okay if i am sharing uh, the data to many people so i'm giving uh, i if i'm a network a single node means i'm sharing data to many nodes okay uh, so this is a secondary example okay mm, so then computer network first we saw about a uh, network then the computer network which means is a to a uh, collection of autonomous computers interconnected by a single technology autonomous which means um, the single rule single rule computers is interconnected by a single technology so uh, each every autonomous computers is interconnected by single technology every system has its own rule right even i we have our own rule uh, we have our um, own passion right so likewise each computers uh, have their own autonomous autonomous, autonomous rule which are interconnected by single technology um, if you are connecting uh, through wi fi means only by wi fi only we can able to uh, connect our device we can able to connect our mobile phone uh, at the same time we can't able to connect uh, by mobile data and wi fi correct so like that every device has its own rule which are interconnected by single technology okay then uh, if two computers are interconnected it means uh, if they able to exchange information the connection needs to be a wire copper in asian days they are uh, the techniques the data information is being passed by copper wires uh, fire fire optics uh, microwaves infrared communication satellites and also been used in later days but nowadays we are being using by a wireless medium correct so uh, in asian days they have been used by copper wires first initial days they have been used by copper wires to transfer uh, to transfer the data so later on uh, they have been uh, introduce um, more technology then the higher version of fiber fiber optics then microwaves um, microwaves is um, we all know uh, the fm uh, fm is being transferred by uh, microwaves and infrared uh, microwaves uh, will will have a certain uh, range but infrared will have some more uh, more uh, range um, than microwave so that uh, and uh, later on the communication satellite communication satellite uh, like uh, we are being using tv satellite tvs uh, dish tvs uh, dish antennas like that we are being used so uh, which uh, which means what that um, the satellite which means the father from the earth uh, they are being uh, connected uh, they are being uh, sent some satellites uh, to connect the devices so uh, the tv station will have a um, connecting Mm, receiver as uh, i mean receiving antennas that we will see uh, in some buildings we have we may see uh, some big uh, dish antennas which which is the receiver of the uh, tv station and we uh, and we we used as small very small uh, receivers so uh, we are uh, we are receiving the signal from the uh, tv station satellites but the tv station satellite uh, dish will receive uh, the data from the uh, satellite the real satellite so uh, the improvement is being uh, improvised later and later and later now we are being used by a wireless so network can come in si uh, many sizes uh, shapes and forms uh, 
they are uh, usually connected to other to make larger network uh, which means uh, if um, if i'm using one to one or system to system means it's a linear way if i'm uh, connecting a device from one to uh, many like one lab to another lab means it, it, the structure will may differ right so the network will based on the sizes if i'm connecting like i said uh, if i'm connecting the device from one to the next the another the alternate the adjacent system means the uh, the shape will be linear if i'm connecting uh, uh, the connect computer from one lab one lab from cc2 to cc4 means the structure will may define uh, it may be a, a irregular shape or a mesh a meshy type um, structures like that so the network will come in sizes they may differ based on the connectivity okay so then uh, distributed system so distributed system is uh, is um, which means uh, like i said and based on the size shape uh, so distributing i'm distributing from one system from my system to from my uh from for to my friends or to my uh staff so like that we are being used uh so distributed system i'm distributing i'm distributing to one to many or one to one distributing can be in uh to one or to many people okay so uh so so this is a distributed system we'll uh see the is the we'll see in the uh next uh, slides uh uh so now till now we have discussed about the history and the introduction part i hope you understand if you are having doubts mean you can ask in the end of the session so uh then we'll see about the use of computers use of computer networks so why we are using what is the user even though we are having uh, so many subjects or operating system architecture uh, data structure like we we have been uh, knowing and reading and learning and um, defining more uh, subject and more topics but for the computer network, what is the use what is the purpose of being used uh, using the network of computer which means first thing there are more things i have uh, listed some of the things first thing is a business application uh, business application uh, so okay we all know this is a common term business for business people they they will they will meet uh, many people they will uh, they will make a business with many people they will contact one to one they will um, reach out to many people so business is a uh, one to many right uh, they will know they will Uh, reach out they will make their business to spread okay right so to spread to spread their business what will they do they will show sir they will share their resources they will show up there what they are doing what they are going to do what is uh, what is a business like that they will they will do so for that for that for the business people for the business uh, uh, participant or the business people they will use a client server model and email model we all know email we used to email one to one so so that so for business people they will use an um, email email system but a client server model is uh, somewhat different than email client server model is uh, is different than uh, email by a single server will be there but a client will be more okay a single server is a business people business uh, owner the client will be the product buyer he will be the owner the product buyer will be the client okay so he will share his uh, property or the money to the client uh, the receiver second thing we are being using uh, the computer network for home application which is uh, we all know we are used to play ps5 uh, or uh, some crummy uh, and uh, so on we used to play some uh, entertainment games uh, chess uh, online online games by the network the the interface is uh, we are we are playing from our home but we can be able to uh, play it in on virtual so uh, the network is a barrier uh is a bridge to connect from your home 
to the um, game you can able to uh, play it on virtual right so this is the purpose of being uh, of uh, being connected with the computer network fine uh, third thing is the mobile users we all using mobile users mobile using uh, Uh, we are using our mobile uh, using our data uh, something like that so that we used to send text uh, issues uh, gps uh, social issues um, we used to uh, text uh, text a message through whatsapp or from uh, from anything else uh, and the second thing is support a uh, gps which you used to track uh, from anywhere uh, like uh, if you lost the mobile phone means we can able to uh, track the devices uh, through uh, from uh, from farthest distance uh, so likewise we can able to uh, use this network to find our device second uh, the last thing is about a social issue we, uh, we are um, if some boats are there uh, we can able to uh, inquire or uh, post some post uh, regarding our own issues or to the uh, or we can able to poll uh, poll the uh, poll them uh, through online um, through online so uh, so that uh, some people may have message boards uh, so the participant or the people can uh, post their uh, own opinions uh, and the content sharing they can able to share their contents like uh, youtube is a content sharing uh, platform uh, message boards we have uh, so many uh, blog websites like that so so even though so these are the things we can able to use but still we have some disadvantages like attacks so some more attacks are there phishing attack bot net attack, attack uh, shoulder attack eavesdropping attack so many attacks are there uh, i have listed two two things which mean first the first thing is a phishing attack stealing phishing uh, phishing is a uh, some people used to say something fishy so the phishing attack which means uh, some people the uh, stealer will steal our logging credential uh, logging credential credit card details they used to we all um, we all uh, heard a video or audio uh, which means uh, the north indian people north indian uh, sorry some north indian uh, uh, call a uh, bank manager uh, like he is a manager he is asking for a credit card number to upgrade uh, your pin details or uh, like that he asked so this is the phishing attack they will uh, they will make make a fake website or make a fake um, uh, data which you used to get their own uh, own uh, password or details so some people some innocent people may lost their data uh, so like that botnet attack is a uh, different from a uh, spam spam uh, they they are fake they will some website will show them they are spam they are fake but uh, so many uh, so many uh, website are not being uh, are not being able to know which is spam which is not spam like likewise we are uh, being uh, struggling uh, through network so uh, we have been able to we are you need to be very careful uh, like uh, if you are searching for any job board means uh, they are va there are various um, job boards in the same name we can able to know we can't able to know which is spam which are fake which are real uh, which uh, website we used to we need to go like we don't know so like that we are we are facing some struggles through network but still if we are uh, cautious means we can able to uh, tackle the, those attacks so then the effectiveness of communication system so uh, each uh, we are using uh, uh, we are using we are uh, sending some messages means uh, which, what are the things we should be able to know if i'm sending a message to uh, our group means what are the things i need to know it should uh, the data the message need to be delivered okay then the accuracy what uh, um uh, did the message uh, I have sent is uh, is being posted correctly? It, uh, if I'm sending a message, hi, hi, how are you? I'm sending that message, but the uh, the message is being sent like, uh, hello, uh, what are you doing? Means the the message is not correct, right? So the accuracy, accuracy, and it's time. It should be on time. It should send it on time. It it should be on timeliness. 
which uh, which i said it should be on time if i uh, mention uh, the data need to be sent on uh, 12 o'clock means the data need to be sent on 12 uh, it should not um, it should not get later on 12 5 or 12 30 it should be on time so the time accuracy and the jitter jitter which means the error uh, it means um, some data which we used to type but the extra um, if i using some phone if you're typing if you're typing some data some word text uh, means uh, some extra words by mistake we used to add some words so then we will delete right so these are the jitters uh, in network some jitter messages uh, some base messages will be added to the uh, our mail which we are um, which we normal path recommend so then the data communication have five components so uh, data communication data communication is the message communication which have uh, five components first thing is the sender receiver so between the sender receiver only we have can able to send messages and the medium and the protocol so while the sender uh, sending a message through a medium medium is called um, through wi-fi or through um, a land cable or through a fire five uh, coaxial cable like that here he has been sending means so the message will pass through the the medium of the uh, data then the protocol which means a, a protocol which is uh, protocol is a set which means a rule on what rule he has to send he has some a set of rules uh, he have to send for message text for normal text uh, here only this type uh, this range of uh, letters we need to send so the text normal text have some set of rules uh, so likewise every uh, data every network have some uh, rules have some uh, set of protocol so these are the data communication system components so then a data flow how the data is being flow from the center to the receiver so uh, here uh, some two uh, communication data flows which is simplex and half duplex or full duplex simplex means a uh, one to one i now is now we are being uh, in a simplex mode i can talk but you can't able to talk so this is the simple mode simplex mode but half duplex or full duplex means which means at the end of the session i've used to ask i may ask uh, if anybody is uh, having those you can ask me we have a discuss session we can talk one to one yeah, or you can ask i will be quiet so these are this is the example for half duplex and full duplex okay uh simplex is me i am talking you are listening so is a simplex more half and uh, full duplex means the discussion discussion session um i can ask you can reply so like that uh so like that uh which is explained in the brief manner uh, is a simplex mode is the connection uh, communication uh, is unidirection the one way so uh, which means in network lay in uh, in technology or standard uh, meaning keyboard keyboard uh, keyboard and mouse are being um, keyboard mouse or a um, usb drive is a what uh, simplex mode uh, which uh, one only keyboard can able to play or able to work at a time single time not monitor can able to answer it uh, to keyboard right so mouse also is giving an input device input device is a simplex mode half duplex uh, for half and uh, full duplex means walkie talkie uh, pol uh, the police is used to uh, have a walkie talkie hello over over where are you over over so like that we are being used the half duplex mode First, the half first uh, one person to one uh, police will uh, talk. The the receiver uh, receive uh, the data. Then he will uh, talk uh, so simultaneously. So in the half uh, in walkie talkie, so many data will be transferred at a time. So because uh, so many people will use through frequencies. As I said, uh, the medium of um, communication is through microwave or uh, infrared uh, so uh, walkie talkie is one of the technologies being used by the wave 
wave technology is being used so so many frequencies uh, so many uh, people will use the same frequencies so we can able to uh, hear uh, so many voices so many background voices at the same time so like we said the radios only uh, uh, only we can use uh, so we can able to replay so half duplex but in full duplex we can able to communicate uh, both at a time so uh, like chat we can able to chat in whatsapp we can able to chat both at a time right so i can message you can message so it's a full duplex mode okay uh, now uh, a physical topology now we are seeing about the topologies what are the topologies in the network so the first thing a physical topology mesh star bus wing i will tell you the overview uh, topology is in the sense how as i said um, the distributed data system uh, distributed system as uh, i said right so i can uh, which means i said uh, network is have uh, some shape some forms uh, some some things uh, need to be uh, followed so the shape uh, the technology is how the shape um the form is uh, i said i mentioned right uh, the shape and the form uh, which uh, which is used in the topology um, method in topology we have four kind of uh, topologies mesh topology star topology bus and ring uh, i'll say this uh, somewhat way first mesh uh, we all know mesh meshy 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 the word uh, means it's a um, congested it's a um, we all know uh, I, for example uh, we we may saw uh, a fish net it's a uh, it's a, it's like a machine net meshy method or a, a mosquito net uh, we is a it's, it seem like a square square manner like a like or pinna na madri irukum or epdi solla or or machine a mosquito net mesh eppadi irukum adu vandha appadina or construction appadina romba close network ah irukum romba congested ah irukum okay va ah but uh, so mesh for mesh network uh, they are being used uh, to this is very congested one so we are uh, we can able to um, able to transfer or uh, transmit many data at a time so we are using uh, the star network so star network for, for star network also we can uh, uh, star we uh, just as we used to star uh, feed our star means we have uh, five or four points so only four uh, only four uh, computers can able to connect at a time so it is uh, more efficient than mesh network but but in in uh, bus uh, network but uh, in bus uh, technology we can able to but in bus uh, topology it is more efficient than a star it is a bus as a linear way bus will go uh, in a linear way right so it has some station some compartment um, some station and uh, we are uh, from one station to another station it will stop so it will be in a linear way for bus we are be using lan uh, so later on i will explain so then the ring, ring is a, a circle it will be can be in circle or triangle method only some uh, it is uh, equivalent to bus but in a uh, closed manner like just okay then these are the structures um structure as i said in the um mesh is a uh, it's um being it's a mesh is a combining combination of uh, a bus and a uh, ring uh, topology it will be constructed as a meshy way the star um topology uh will be a uh will will be like this uh from one station two station three station but has a half of one two three four like that from that uh, it will connect to on our two more station but in bus and so it is connected in a linear method it is connected in a linear way so can be connected no um no internet connections no uh, no um, intermediate levels no intermediate connection or intermediate uh, data passing uh, way 
then uh, ring and hybrid. Uh, ring is a, as I said, is a, um, it will be like uh, similar to bus, but it will be in a closed manner. So like that, hybrid is a combination of all, all the four. Uh, bus, mesh, uh, star, and the ring is a combination of all the uh, four things. So, but uh, but I said, as I said, um, it is one one um, when we compare one with another, it will be different from one place to one place. Uh, if uh, if a corporate uh, company means they will use a mesh uh, mesh uh, type of topology. Um, in a single, just a um, uh, just a simple IT company, a start startup company means they will use a, a star uh, and a ring based uh, topology because they have a so simple, uh, very small area of uh, workspace. So they will use a star topology or a ring topology. In bus topology, we are um, can you able to. Uh, grasp uh, where we are being used the land technology sorry and the bus technology we are be using the colleges no because uh, bus technology is being uh, called as a land network uh, which means it's a lean away from one system to another system uh, but we can't able to uh, communicate in bus technology in bus topology uh, the one disadvantage is about we can't able to communicate from one to uh, the third one uh, uh, if uh, station one is be, uh, uh, can be able to pass the information from one to station two, but you can't be able to uh, share its information from one station one to station three. It can't. It, it is not possible to transfer. So, like this, the disadvantages and advantages being um, uh, differ from one to one. But in hybrid level, you can able to use all the things, uh, ring mesh and. Uh, every topology we can able to use so uh, finally uh, type of network uh, type of network is about um, LAN, man man so uh, i'll say in a simple way uh, LAN, which is uh, used uh, in a room uh, in home or in uh, oh, every lab in every lab we have used uh, LAN because it's a small area of workspace uh, so this is, you can you just need a very simple network to connect from one to another. So we are being used a LAN cable. Uh, in our college also, we are being used um, LAN cable, we are, uh, gray color cable, right? We used to connect uh, from, to the uh, cable, we are being used a uh, network. So it has this, uh, this is a common connecting device. So through that, we are uh, it's a common point, junction point. From then, from the junction point, we can able to uh, transfer the data from to all the devices in man. But uh, it has a very, very short range. Uh, only in meters only, we can able to uh, use the LAN. But uh, so it is not uh, uh, later technology is growing. We can't able to use it. So uh, later, uh, later on, they have invented some. Uh, to reach a maximum limit, so they uh, introduced a man metropolitan area network. Uh, in the metropolitan area network, it can able to cover up to five to fifty kilometers at a time. So, for that, uh, how how they have uh, connected, uh, covered uh, five to fifty kilometers by data transfer. So uh, they have uh, connected uh, five to fifty kilometers through. The date uh, they have increased the data transfer rate. Um, uh, so they have increased the data transfer rate and the uh, network resources. So they may uh, they may uh, have uh, for LAN we have uh, one junction point in a single room. For MAN they may, uh, they may have two more junction point from two, five to ten kilometers or five to ten kilometers they may have single junction point then five to uh, 20 kilometers they have uh, another junction point so they increase the junction points and the uh, so through that they have increased the coverage it, it coverage area so finally we have wide area in terms we can able to so it is more uh, effective uh, and uh, accurate uh, than the man metropolitan area in van which is a specialized mean we can able to uh, 
cover world wide network we can able to cover world wide network which means a satellite which are a satellite can able to cover more range the over around the globe it can able to um, cover it so uh, it is a uh, this is the things this this is the types of network uh, land man uh, but uh, beyond that Mm, we have uh, so many networks being used but uh, in some uh, in some of the places they, they are being used um, blan wireless area network which means we all know the word we we doesn't know the word wireless uh, wireless lan but uh, we know the word wifi this uh, wireless lan is defined is also called as wifi we are being used wifi through radio frequencies uh, uh radio frequency we are being used um wifi uh if uh, uh some some network some wifi will have this certain of uh, range this uh, certain range of mbps uh, so based on the bit rate and the uh, bits per second we can able to uh, cover up the range uh, from it will differ from place to place so we can able to uh, adjust the rate a range of uh, the mbps okay uh, like if we uh, increase the mbps means we can able to cover a high range if you are shortening the range means we can able to cover up only short range so uh, if we provide short range connectivity with a high speed data transmission means if you are uh, if i uh, giving wifi connection to a single room means which is a short range connectivity but my phone uh, if i am watching a high end uh, uh, high quality uh, video means i can able to watch it on uh, perfect range without any buffering so if i am uh, making uh, a short range of connectivity means i can able to uh, send messages or able to uh, send a high um, high storage message also i can able to send in a fraction of minutes but if i have uh, connected in a very uh, long range or a very big range Uh, means i can if my uh, data my data transmission time will be less because uh, so many range uh, i have increased my range uh, so many people will use at the same time so the data can be uh, send very slower the data transmission speed will be uh, lower so uh, if we uh, make the range short means we can able to uh, send the data on time so then the pan personal area network we used to say the word pan pan india so which is a network or is by its uh, individual user for its personal use so if uh, i am uh, i am customizing uh, my network i want this kind of network i need a short range with a short uh, speed of data transmission means i can able to customize so it is a personal use uh, some business people some in co- corporate people they use the personal area network so they have will customize their own settings uh, in the network then the storage area network which is a which connect the server to the data storage device uh, if i'm uh, which means uh, if i'm connecting my uh, drive network if i'm connecting my set of data into a single server i can i won't i can only able to access i can able to only um, give authorize i can able to increase my range i can able to only edit or view or uh, comment anything on the uh, on my uh, data so i am using only for the storage i can only able to like a drive google drive is only to store the data the information documents the larger files i can able to use so for that only we are being used as pan area network uh, like um, data mining big data uh, machine learning like we say can uh, for that they can use a pan network so uh, if uh, if i am if I, in my home uh, i am having a server in mean i need the storage so where i can uh, able to store so i can use the storage area network through a uh, fiber optic cables so these are the other types of network which is being customized for every person to person or uh, from company to companies so finally we are use, uh, we are uh, we will see about the layers behind the network or a layers inside the network uh, as i said uh, the data transmission from one to one another to another uh, in a closed manner everything i said but what are uh, what 
are the things inside the network what are the things is being happened inside the network means these are the layers inside the network these are the network uh, layers so we have seven layers from bottom to top we, uh, we used to see um, first as a physical layer physical layer uh physical layer data link layer transport uh, network layer transport layer session layer presentation layer application layer so these are the layers we are being used uh, for every layer some this this is all these layers can also be customized by person to person okay for physical layer for physical layer uh first i'm going to send a message means the data will be the message will be uh, split into bits first uh, the data frame if i'm uh, sending a message hi how are you means the data uh, the message will be split into bits zeros and ones or other uh, set of hi hello how are you the four it, it will be split in four uh, you we can able to we can also able to customize um our own with or else we can able to uh, if i'm sending uh email means the email uh the email server will have a set of uh bit range uh they will um custom it uh in on their own way so the first message message will be uh split into bits then the message will be uh constructed into frames frames in the sense uh like a cover frame is about a cover so uh the the messages are splitted but it should be uh, it should not be um if i'm uh like uh, how i said uh if i'm if i'm packing if i'm um, making some uh biscuit okay i'm having a biscuit of uh some 10 10 biscuits then 10 number of biscuits okay how will i uh send from one to from from me to my friend how will i send so first i will split five five or two two likewise i will, I will split or i can send uh, 10 at a time right so that i can customize the number of uh data i uh, which, which i'm going to send so first i will uh, make the biscuit so biscuit is about you, you just think it's a message okay i'm just uh, telling you the uh, example for biscuit but you can tell it as a biscuit just think uh, in a biscuit man okay i'm sending 10 number of biscuit to my friend i'm going to send 10 number of biscuit to my friend i'm uh, first uh, i'm first i took on the 10, 10 number of biscuit it is i can split 10 2 2 or 3 3 i can it's my wish then there uh I, I can i can't able to um distribute this 10 number of biscuit to my friend because it may be fall down uh, on the way it may be broken so i making uh, a frame a cover or a package so the frame is uh, nothing but a packet this to segregate or to, or to collect the uh, number of uh, data so then uh, so i'm uh, making to uh, seal it i'm going to see by frames then the packet packet is nothing but we can able to i'm uh, I'm, I'm i'm going to see first i'm uh, having 10 number of biscuit then i'm sealed then i'm making a uh, packet so i'm making a cover packet or polythene packet or paper packet so i'm, I'm making a packet then i'm segmenting data I'm segmenting segmenting and data crime so i'm next level of um is a segmentation segmentation is in how how much of packet i'm going to send i, I, I have sent a uh, two i uh, make a packet as one so how many segmentation how many uh how many datagrams how many set of packets how many set of packets i'm going to send i have uh i have um make it as a one packet so i'm going to I'm not going to segment. I'm going to segment as a one, one thing. So the data will be moved on to the next session. So session establishment, synchronization, dialogue controller. So the biscuit packet will be session establishment. Session establishment in the sense, 
proceeding proceeding i'm going to i'm 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 going to I'm going to my friend's house i mean i'm going to give uh, i'm going to give to my friend so the establishment the next uh, i uh, close the pack i'm going to give to my friend so the session establishment establishing the uh, initiating the step the the message is uh, ready to send is going to receive at the end uh, send receiver side so session establishment the session is going to be open so if the session is open means you can the message will pass on to the from center uh, sender to receiver this is a session establishment is the gate uh, between the sender and the receiver if the session is uh, open means uh, the message will forward to the receiver so i'm going to a uh, so i'm going to the gate the gate uh, the gate is opening i'm going to my friend house so then encryption or decryption compression i'm uh, i'm going to my friend house i'm pack i have my message i have my pack basket packet now the uh, uh, my friend may ask i'm i'm visiting my old friend means he may ask or she may ask uh, who are you uh, where are you from so like this some in encryption will be done or else we may ask uh, is that my friend house is that other person house i may I, I, i want to know whether i am sending the data i am sending the data to the correct person and the receiver should check uh, i am receiving the data from the correct person so the encryption decryption compression will be uh, present then the data will be uh, received by the uh, send so these are the layers first then the data will be segmented in bits which means the uh, the splitting then the data will be uh, uh, frames then the packet then segmenting and session establishment and encryption and the message uh, mail services directory services so these are things is being happen in every step so uh, these uh, this is the step this is the layer is being in a summary way but uh, in the every layer it has own set of protocol own set of uh, rules and uh, technologies being used uh, inside the every layer physical layer data link layer transport layer network layer session layer trans uh, presentation layer uh, application layer. in every layer we have some certain rules okay so these are the layers and its uses so every layer has its own rule and own way some people will use as only the physical layer some people will only use the data link layer so it based on it can also be customized layer 1 and 2 which is the physical layer and a uh, data link layer this is a network access layer which means the medium the sending uh, initiated to the sender will initiate to uh send initiate to send a message initiate to type a message so e ethernet token tree uh arp rarp these are the protocol uh these are the protocol in which medium uh, they are going to be used in which uh, set of frames token tree is a set of frames which in which uh thing which they have been used, going to use which um, bridge they are going to use which is which they are going to be used like this they can be able to uh, transfer their message in the network access the third layer is internet so how they are going to if i am uh, sending my message to another message no another device means i can be able to send it through ip address also so if i am if i know the ip address mac address means i can be able to forward the message through ip address right so so through the, for that uh, we we need a router firewall uh, firewall is a barrier which uh, won't allow the viruses or the uh, attacks right so then the host to host the one to one uh, for that we are using tcp transmission control protocol user datagram protocol which is a gateway which is a gate Uh, which uh, will verify which will authenticate the data uh, from where it is coming where, where which from which address which ip address is being used uh, like which are uh, based so uh, then in the final 5 and 6 7 layers uh, dns uh, telnet http 
uh, we are being used HTTP and HTTPS. Uh, HTTPS in the sense is that uh, HTTP in the sense just a protocol from uh, which uh, protocol we being used, uh, which uh, uh, which protocol there are so many protocols. So which protocol being used or going to transfer? Which I, which I, uh, protocol is being going to be customized? Like that we can uh, we can uh, do by ourselves. Uh, so which devices in the sense we can able to uh, mail server, a uh, main client or web server. So we can use our own way or devices or application. So these are the layers, uh, layer one, two, uh, three, four, five, six, seven, and it's a model. In which model, network model, internet model, host to host model, application model, then the protocol is being used by the layers and the devices is being used by the layers. So, um, these are the things we are discussed today. Okay, just I will over you. First, this uh, is all about the history, then the introduction part, then the communication, how we are, are transferring from one data to uh, one computer, another computer, uh, then uh, how is being used uh, and what are the things behind and inside the uh, network and what are the layers is being used uh, in uh, the network so these are the introduction one this is only the introduction part uh, for uh, these are the only introduction part in later uh, in later in the sense um, if we go if we go through the in depth topic means the, in every layer it is uh, the content will be um, go in depth so these are the layers which can which has a, a very strong uh, depth contents uh, we, we should know we should be able to understand very clear so uh, later um, you should know uh, what are the things inside the physical layer, what are the things going uh, going happen inside the layers so we should know so these are things we discussed about today thank you thank you so much is uh, anybody having doubts you can ask. Did you understand the concept? Am I clear to you? Am I clear to you? Okay. Okay. Thank you, Pan. Thank you.